Hey guys, uh, I'm here with another backyard roller coaster update video. So as you can see off camera, what I did since last episode was extend the straight section between the first drop and the first hill. Uh, so yeah, I said I was going to do that last video and I couldn't get many shots of it just because I wanted to power through. So just doing a quick update on it now. Uh, so yeah, this video, I'm just going to discuss what I did off camera, and then I'll, I'll film a couple of build lapses, and I will show you the next piece of track that's going to top off that first hill. So uh, yeah, I'm just going to quickly flash a quick before and after picture, just so you can see the big difference of the straight section. So yeah, that, uh, as you see, the straight section got a lot bigger. There's like a good 14 foot piece of uh, straight section right there now, which is a huge improvement. I think it will make the roller coaster a lot smoother and safer, plus it just looks better. And of course, it'll make it bigger. Uh, so yeah, between last video, I actually did a lot of stuff. So obviously, I did that big straight section. I also added supports to the car and the track i'll just quickly show you those so um i added some lateral supports to the track uh, it's these here yeah i know they look not off that's actually just so the so the upstop wheels can pass through so i had to shave a bit off it's still pretty sturdy um before it was just these supports that went straight up and down and those were obviously doing the job for uh for gravity but i needed some lateral support so now the track it's pretty locked in it's not going anywhere it's not going anywhere from side to side so what i also did was these side stop wheels um if you go back to my cart update you might be able to tell they were really bad my side stop wheels were kind of just moving all over the place so now what i did if you can see, um, I basically locked them in with these nails, so the side, side stop wheels are not going anywhere. Uh, so that also made the coaster really smooth, and just like testing it out now, there's a noticeable difference. It is a lot smoother uh, compared to before, because before, even these wheels right here, the side stop wheels would be pushed to the side, and the wheels would not derail, but slip off the track and pretty much stop it to a halt. And obviously that is really uncomfortable. So big improvement right there. So yeah, um, that's really all I did off camera. Now um, I will, actually last thing, what I also did is I reformed the shape of the first hill. It was a lot steeper before honestly before it was still on the incline now you can see it kind of starts to steady off at the top so that's the last thing i did off camera i know there's a lot of updates um but yeah that's the last thing i'm going to play a couple time lapses and we're going to put in this next piece of track to top off the uh first hill so yeah thanks for watching uh, i'll see you in a bit
Hey guys, this is the finished uh, crest of a hill. So, um, yeah, I just have that A support in there and I just capped the hill off. Um, I think it looks pretty good, honestly. Um, obviously, there's gonna have to be some more support between that A um, support and that support over there. Uh, so, yeah, that'll be in next video. I'm also just letting you know. I was just testing it out a bit, a little bit, not from the very top, maybe from halfway, and as you can probably tell, that incline is pretty steep. So, um, a common theme on this uh, video series is trying it out and adjusting it. So, unfortunately, I am going to have to be adjusting it again. So, yeah, I can't move forward, but. As I've said a million times in this series, I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm hoping for the best. I'm trying my best, not giving up. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have to definitely uh, rework this. So you can already see I, I'm I, I'm unattaching it there and up there, and I'm just going to make it just because it's so steep. I'm going to make it more of a uh, more graceful incline. Uh, so yeah, that's it for this video. Um, I'm not really done with this section of track. <laughs> I still have to obviously adjust all of that. So I will see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye.